for Parkside Renovations, we will be basically remodeling the whole interior of the building. We've got several different phases of the project. The biggest will probably be the large instructional spaces. This will be a large instructional space, and be kind of more of an open concept. It'll be very exciting for the students and staff. Walls are coming down. When you walk into local businesses around here or any business in, in any other city, you see places where there are collaborative learning spaces and people are working together. The openness, the flexibility that's involved with that redesign of, of the learning space is what I'm most excited about because I think it sets our kids up for what they will see as they grow and develop and get ready for whatever awaits them after uh, high school. I'm also super excited about the state-of-the-art STEM lab where students can come in and do exploratory learning. They can get engaged with technology, engineering, and math all at one time. We need technology, we need internet connectivity, we need spaces where kids can make podcasts or work independently without noise. And I think that that all lends itself to the way the building is being designed. Some of the historic things for Parkside are the barreled roofs, the laminated beams, and the courtyard, obviously. My goal is when the project's completed that everybody sees that there's value in what we've done here. We've preserved the architectural history of the building, plus we've brought it into the future for the new students that'll be coming in the next 30, 40 years from now.